In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can embed Instagram Reels on your Squarespace website. Now, I have an Instagram account for tutorials, but I don't have any Reels. So I had to think to myself who I could borrow a Reel from for the purposes of this tutorial. And I decided Mr. Diamond Dallas Page. He's one of my favorite human beings on the planet. And he's also founder of DDP Yoga, which I love and do every day. So hopefully he doesn't mind us borrowing one of his Instagram Reels. So if you come back into your website, website, find the section you want to add your Instagram reels to. I'm going to hit edit, scroll down and I'm going to add mine right in here. So click add section, scroll down to images, select this option. And then what we're going to do is hit edit section, this pencil icon, pull this over and you can either choose to have the simple grid or a slideshow reel can work as well. I like to keep it simple. We want to make sure we've selected full bleed aspect ratio we're going to change to two by three vertical we're going to give it six columns and i'm going to remove all spacing now i'm going to click off and then i'm going to hit edit gallery and you'll see here we've got six images you would want to delete those and you will need a visual for each reel you add so either take a screenshot from the reel or you can customize the cover here i'm only going to delete one for now so that you can see how this works and then what we're going to do is hit the plus icon upload our image. You see here, I've just uploaded a screenshot and then I'm going to go down where it says link. I'm going to come back in, grab the reel link here, copy this, paste it in here. And then I'm going to click this gear icon and make sure it's open in a new window. We don't want to divert people away from our website. So if it opens in a new window, they can view it while still being on the website. Hit save close. I'm going to hit done and save again. And as you can see that Instagram reel is now showing. And if we click on it, it's going to open up on Instagram. Now you one, you would want to do this for your own reels, not other people's. And two, you would just follow the same steps for all six reels that you want to display. Now this also works with TikTok and it can also work with YouTube shorts as well. Hey, if you like this video, there's a good chance you'll also like this one. 